Do you find your Magic the Gathering matches to be boring and lackluster, putting you to sleep on the battlefield? Have you run out of places to store all of your Magic cards? Does your lack of Commander Synergy haunt you in your nightmares? If so, then we have just the product to spice up your life. Hi, I'm Matt from Commander Cube, and I'm going to teach you how to take command of your MTG experience. Tired of buying booster packs? We're just gonna send them to you. Tired of making up new combos for your new commander decks? We're gonna send those to you too. Tired of buying stuff at your LGS? We're gonna send you cool stuff that you couldn't buy at your LGS, like token notebooks. And, well, you can get the, 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 the box at your LGS, but you can't get this soap. You can't get the soap at the LGS, and a lot of people at your LGS need this soap. You should probably share it. No, you probably shouldn't share it, but you can buy some more on our store and give it to somebody at your LGS make everything smell a little better. Like a forest. Commander Cube is built using cutting edge technology. Let's talk to our Commander Cube scientist and see what he has to say about the process. I'm a scientist. Say you were playing with a friend, or well he was a friend, until you stabbed him because he played this stupid combo. Blood on your playmat? Need to clean it up? Cops coming soon? Watch this, you're gonna love it. Boom, it's gone. Commander Cube, talk about a card combo. That's a get out of jail free card, friend. Alternatively, just spilled a little soda on your playmat because you're not a psychopath, not a murderer, not a problem. Just give it a little rub, boom. No jail time with that one either. You just spilled soda. Don't take my word for it. Listen to these other people that you don't know. Commander Cube is so easy, you don't even have to put on pants. That's awesome, I'm super excited for that. How did you get in my house? Commander Cube is the most original MTG subscription box on the market. You're telling me that I can get a legendary creature with a curated commander pack in my choice of color or colors, booster packs, and custom sideboard items delivered to my door every other month for the low, low price of just $30? Sign me up! Look at the camera and smile. How's Call 1-800-COMMANDER-CUBE now to get signed up. Or just use this link down below, because they're telling me right now that that number does not exist. But wait! Act now, and you'll get even more than the packs, the cards, and the sideboard items. You get... This guy! Bro. You're gonna have to pay extra shipping for him, though. He's, he's, you know, he's a human being. We're gonna treat him as such. He goes in a nice box. Not a coffin, though. It's a nice box. Rob. Hey, and we're back. We're hey. gonna start our first duel, and uh, I'm, I think we're gonna go with some little bugs. W with Weevil Underwood? Weevil Underwood, which is already kind of a British sounding name. They didn't even have to change <laughs> that one at all. <laughs> so you're the legendary Rose Duelist. Prepare to face the sting of my insect deck. You watched the show right before this. That's probably almost exactly his actual voice. Is it actually? That's actually how he talks I, in the show, I, I, as I, don't I remember, remember it. All I remember is that I always hated him. Someone can comment and, you know, pull, post a video of him talking, but I'm pretty sure that's almost exactly what he sounds like. I'm he was obnoxious. <laughs> All right, so 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 welcome to the first duel that you guys are gonna see. So th this is it. It is a 3D like grid based thing. Okay, so the way it's gonna work, okay, um, that go. that that is your uh, that, my leader. Th yeah, that, that's our leader. That's hashtag Rosie right there. Um, so if you press X, you're gonna select the leader and then you can move uh, in yeah. in one space. Uh, now your leader cannot attack. They can't really do anything except they can summon. Mm -hmm. uh, so if you hit circle to cancel it out, or if you want to move, that's you're, you're welcome let's, to. Let's move one forward. Let's right. be aggressive. So here. press square B. So square opens up your summoning thing. B. You can B. summon anywhere B. around you. Yep. So probably like right in front of you, or right there, and that those are your cards. If you okay. need more details about them, like that guy has an effect. If you press triangle, it'll go ahead and bring up a, a menu. You oh. scroll down, uh, and it, you gain a thousand bonus points when engaged in battle with machine, machine monsters. monsters. So, okay. so it's good against machine. Then there's power up cards that I think that's like what can affect it. I think like what you can. Yeah. Yeah, it's to not it. selectable, so it's not um, like I can. Yeah, so I I, I don't really there. know if that's like, if that's how that works. Uh, so, so you can choose anything. Um, I can't summon anything over four. You can. I oh can. Yeah. So in this one, it's not like so, so you There's have some no, experience that you go. Yeah, yeah. So uh, normally you have to like sacrifice monsters and yeah. to like you summon sacrifice higher ones. anything three and under for a four. So in this, left. on the top left and right, those are the two duelists. So we're on the left. Uh, you, our little stars say four right now. You start the yeah. duel four. Every turn you get three. Oh, okay. And they add up. So okay, so it's kind of like a like a static yeah, mana yeah, kind yeah. of thing. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So so they they accumulate over time. So I can I can burn all four on a creature, but then next turn I'm only going to be able to play three. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. 
Let's go. Does this guy have any stuff? So, no? so, so some liquid beast. Zaragon. You know, I'm gonna let's uh, put out something. Maybe he'll. He's not gonna play a machine. Yeah, that's so, that's yeah, that's let's, like, yeah. Uh, let's Weevil out, Underwood is gonna do that. Uh, yeah, a bug machine. You never. All know. right. So now, before you press X again, so now you have the option to or, or press X on him. Then now that you put him down, he's face down by default. If you move him and then press X, you'll move the guy. If yeah. you press R1 or L1, you'll switch oh, him into defense and, attack. defense and attack. And yeah. if you press L2 or R2, you'll flip him up or keep him face down. Okay. Uh, so they won't get revealed. Yeah, I'm going to keep him face down here. And he's stronger in attack mode, so I'll leave him there. All right. So then you want to move forward? All yeah. right. Now that your turn is over, you can only like summon one thing, I think, per yeah. turn. Uh, you can just press uh, start, and th that ends your turn. Oh, look. I can look at my hand and everything. Cool. Yeah. Let's see what this... Praying Mantis is going to so, do for us. Okay, he's moving away. Yeah, so he, yeah, he he's, he's setting his front line in and he's running away because yeah. he's a little bug and he's afraid that we're going to crush him. Because we're probably going to crush him. <laughs> let's let's All right. move to counter him and we'll summon another guy over here. All right, so now here's... Oh, hey, Ooh, you have a magic I've got a card. Spell. Let's do the Aqua Chorus. Aqua Chorus. Right. Uh, boost the attack and defense factors of all water monsters on the field by Ooh. 500 points. And this uh, uh, is, is liquid a static beast? effect. Let's see what liquid beast is here. Let's back at him. There we go. Let's take a look here. That is aqua. Okay, so yeah, that'll yeah, affect him aqua. too. So he would have an extra 500 uh, bonus attack. Yeah, that's pretty good. That is pretty dope. So okay, so the magic card. I I I don't know. Does we're actually all liquid here? Oh wow, that's perfect. Yeah. So so maybe you want to get another, another guy, on the guy field? out. Yeah. Let's um. A turtle tiger? Can you imagine seeing any of these creatures in real life? Yeah, that's kind of terrifying. Look at it. Yeah. Does it have back legs, or can we just not see it? <laughs> They're retracted into the shell. <laughs> into the shell. With back legs. <laughs> All forward. All for full speed ahead, Captain. Uh, I'm gonna go ahead and uh, let's, let's put this. Get a in. night lizard going on. Uh, so, so, so you have played the card game, like the actual physical yeah, card game, I and, used to and actually you watched play a the lot. show. Yeah, I watched the show a little bit uh, when I was younger. And I, pl I played the card game a lot. Really? Yeah. Yeah, like, that's that That was my first card game I actually played. I got Pokemon cards when they came out, but, um, you know, I didn't I didn't understand it because I was, I was a kid. But um, what happens if I move this guy? You just kind of move him there. Yeah. Yeah. I'll put him right there. Yeah, no, no, we're not Very really going to know what happens until until one of you guys try, tries to move over the other guy. Okay. Which he's probably going to. Yeah, they're, he's probably. They're, hopefully. They're, they're very curious, usually. Oh, yeah? Yeah, so let, let's see what's going on. Oh, he is way better than yours. Oh, damn. Um, but here we go. Now it's time to get to the real biz. Well, that's fine, because you know Saturday what? It's Saturday night, SmackDown in the forest. In the, the, the oddly crowded forest with one small clearing. <laughs> he looks like he's very happy. Like yeah. He's like, yeah, oof, God, man, a punch right to the kisser, and just, and that's out. it. One and done. Night, night, night punch. Round one. Not on, not even on a round two. So, um, I'm sure you'll end up hearing it at a point in time when, when, when these monsters die. He looks like uh, Calculon. He does look like Calculon. He's like that's why I... bug Calculon. <laughs> not in this not photo, in but he in looks the like animation. a nightmare on this one. Yeah, he looks like a horrifying nightmare. In um, oh, wow, so we got 1,500 I, on the field. Yeah, and he he took our life points down by eight hundred. Oh yeah, that goes straight through. Okay. Yeah, if it's attack to attack. Yeah. Then the difference uh, happens to your life points. Um, okay, so it, it's our turn now. So l l let's see what we can do. Let's. Uh, let's... No, I want to go to. Yeah, summon that what guy. What can we summon? Okay. Okay, now now uh, this guy over here, Bolt Penguin. Oh no, he's Thunder, so he wouldn't get affected by yeah. the Aqua spell. No, that would be um, good. So though. you know what? Maybe because we, maybe we can save up to get to get yeah. some Turtle ti Tiger action. Save up next time, yeah. But yeah, we, we could put Aqua Chorus down. We could. What's this? He's a. Okay. Yeah, so he would get that. Night and, Lizard and, would get that boost, and he can and take he would him be... out. Oh, no, he no, couldn't. No, he's he a wouldn't. seventeen fifty. Oh, I read man. his defense as his, as his attack. Oh, That's... you know what it is? It's because you're in the forest. Yep, they've got a boost on yeah, everything. Yeah, he's, he's, he's got a boost against that. Ooh, yeah, man. Let's... Yeah, normally he's a 1250, but because of... So the... how typical is this? Fucking Weevil's cheating. Yeah, right? That, uh, that's, Shocker. Those are the two things that I remember about Weevil. I hated his guts, and he always cheated with everything. Oh, absolutely. Okay, All right. so I guess maybe I should put this out on the field. Does, yeah. This is a persistent effect. Do I actually have to summon this, or does this? Let's see. Yeah, yeah. So, so, so you put it down, and, and then, then I can flip that at some point. Yeah. So now it, you can also move it. Yeah, you can move it around because you can kind of like fake it out. Like, yeah. Like charge oh, in yeah, a magic that's, card, that's another, yeah. and they wouldn't know. Yeah, I'm, I'm dropping my uh, my trap card here. Yeah. 
Oh. What? Oh, wow. Okay. Block attack. Well, I didn't attack you. He didn't. Oh, I... but he just burned his trap card. Cool. Sure. Good good fake. Uh, yeah. Glad that uh, worked out. Nice job, Weevil. Yeah, we won't move. There's no real reason to move, really. Other than to get farther away from that, right, but yeah, I don't want to back I, into I guess a corner. you could start moving your guy a little closer. Yeah, move forward a little? No, 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 no. Oh. You're, uh... You, oh, this you're, guy. Yeah, yeah, your night lizard. Get closer to him. Because if you attack him directly... Directly, yeah. I he has zero... Like, he doesn't fight Zero back. defense, yeah. Yeah. Okay, let's, uh... That'll be our turn. Yeah, no, I used to play a lot of Yu-Gi-Oh. I played at, uh, Barnes & Noble near my house. I used to... Did you ever do, like, like a... Week. Like a tournament? They had small tournaments there all the time. And I used to do those, but, uh... I wasn't, uh... Up, particularly up, 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 up. amazing at the oh, my, oh god. my god what is this this is the first guy this is this is the first duel and uh i don't even have anything in my hand that could have beaten that no ever. I'll, 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 teach, I'll teach you a trick this turn to mill your hand a bit god damn Ouch. what an execution shot and then when they die if you listen <sighs> it does like that yeah like a weird breath it's like thing. the final breath he reminds me of um, the Prince of Egypt. Oh, yeah. Yeah, there, there's like a scene where the Angel of Death comes out, and I do this with my brothers all the time, but it like comes into a house with this kid holding a pot in his hand, and you just see like the kid walk inside, and the, the camera doesn't follow him, and then you just hear, ah, and then the guy, the kid's like hand just comes out the door, and like a pot breaks. And I don't know why. That scene is the one that stuck with me forever. That's always the weird ones. That all right, all right. Okay, so let's, let, no, let's go to, how do we go to hand? Yeah, uh, the summon. Oh, yeah, I just got a summon. Yeah. Okay. okay. Um, what the fuck is that thing in your, in your last thing? Uh, that's a Yadokaru. You can't say that, like, obviously it's Yadokaru. Oh, uh, yeah, Duh. you don't know the Yadokaru? It's okay. like a shell lobster crocodile dragon. All right, so, so, so here's the thing you can do. Uh, I think 600 Lobster Man... Yeah. Um, and 600 uh, Hidonden Chak uh, aren't going to be really useful for us. No, probably not. Uh, so what you should do is, who are we going to summon? Uh, t t Turtle Tiger? Uh, probably Turtle. I mean, if we're just going to summon it in defense mode, probably right now, because I don't have anything that could be. All right. Go all the way to the left. All the way to the left. Press up. Now go to the right. Press up again. No, no, no. On, on, on the, the yeah, yeah. Guy, that guy. And then go to tur Turtle Tiger and press up. So it queues up the three, and you'll use uh -huh. all three. Okay. But the purpose of it is that this is how you fuse cards in this game. Oh, okay. So if you had two monsters that actually, like, polymerize into a thing, this yeah. is how you do it. Polymerization, yeah. Yeah. So, uh, yeah, just go ahead and do this. Well, we've got one, two, three, four. I've got, I've got too much. I only have six it, stars. It should let us. Oh, yeah? I okay. think. I think it, what matters is the final product. Oh, okay. So let's... Oh, yeah. See, okay. It's got me at, at four. Yeah. Oh no, it doesn't. That's that's weird. Okay, let's do that though. Yeah, so it sh it should just bump out these guys, unless it actually fuses into something. Yeah. You don't know. Oh yeah, just bumped. Nope. Nope. Nothing. But we got rid of some some doo doo cards. Yeah. Which sucks. Like, why does this guy have two thousand four hundred guys? Um. Nope. Probably don't want to do that. Yeah. I'm wait. Do that. So th that guy had like twenty. Uh, how much? How, how much points did he have? Put him in defense mode. He's got twenty-four. 20, ooh, okay. Okay. And twenty-two. Okay. So if you put him into defense mode. And then flip him up. Oh, and and well, then flip up your magic card. Well, does well. Let's let's. One sec. Let's. Does this affect both their attack and defense? I thought it was. Oh, it's attack and defense. Yeah. And it's by six hundred. Oh, we could have won before. Yeah, that's six hundred. It does say six hundred. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. So so, but I think they have to be face up. In yeah, order they for it to do. Count. To count. So for that. so, so we'll flip him over in defense mode. Move. Flip him over. Yeah. In defense mode. And then. Activate that. Activate it in defense mode. <laughs> Activate it in de Aqua Chorus, defense mode. There we go. Okay. There, he's 21 now. Wait. What? What? His defense was only 1,500. We misread. We, we're bad at math. What is happening? But you want to know what he I thought. I thought his defense was higher than that. I thought it was. I, I didn't really read it too much. We probably should read a little more. We, we probably should. The, the, the problem is that there's so much forest. Like, there's, there's, like, two deserts and, like, a mountain, I think. Yeah. But, like, we need more of that. We, we, and I, I'm pretty sure we have terrain cards that will alter the terrain a bit. But up until now, and and, and he's going to whoop our ass right now. Oh, he's going to destroy um, us. So he's on, he's on what they call favorable territory, and that lets him move two spaces. So I thought that... We were gonna get a freebie. He wouldn't be able to attack us. 
on this guy. But we but, didn't do math. Um, oh, hey, we do see its hind legs now. We were worried oh, about that true. earlier. Oh, that's true. We have now hind legs confirmed. That turtle shell did absolutely nothing, nothing. for him. Hey, do you know Ninja Turtles? I, I don't yeah. mean to like get, get off into like a weird tangent, but you know the song, yeah. like where it's like like Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles, heroes in a half shell. Yeah, I like, never like understood that. What Just, the fuck is a half shell? Don't they not have the full shell? They only have the top of it. They don't have the bottom part. Yeah, but the bottom part isn't like not it's really not like shell. it's skin. It's still it's pretty true. tough. And like the whole entirety is a shell. Like like, like when when a turtle. I've got more. Ooh, what 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 is that? Disposable we'll trap that spell. spellbinds activated enemy for one turn and reduces the strength by six hundred points. So spellbinding makes it like it it can't do anything. They can't yeah. move it. They can't even touch it. What? Why would we want? Oh, this is why. So in wasteland, our guy is sucks ass. He is zero because his. Oh yep. That's what it is. Oh, and he's brought down by Wasteland, too, because he's yeah. Aqua. Yeah, as well, you can tell by... That's like, great for being yeah, Aqua. It's, it's, this it's, is... T yeah, down. We really down. fucked up. We picked the wrong one. We really did. For the for this battle. So, w what does that magic card do? Uh, this the, is Tears of the Marine. Disposable Trap. That's... No, not that one. Oh, the other we one? We saw that one. Yeah, oh, yeah. Displays the, opponent's hand. The Illuminati for five eye. seconds. Five seconds. Um, that shit matters. It does. Look at a little aerial there. Oh, uh, let's... I mean, I, I guess our best bet is to yeah put put out the dolphin. Oh, no, 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 no. I mean, the mermaid, the the, the trap card. Yeah, yeah, trap card probably the best thing. Let's enter. Yeah, and then just like get it closer to you, I guess. Yeah. So if if he happens to get it, it'll weaken him. Maybe we can summon something at that point that'll yeah. actually be useful. Actually, do anything. Yeah, he's he's destroying us. Yeah, I, I I'm sorry, guys, that we're getting. We're getting wrecked. So thoroughly annihilated by the. Oh, he's. I'm he's not messing with that. Up. I'm not oh, facing that with that card. Uh, at least it worked a little. Oh my god, I think this gives him more life points. God oh damn it. Oh my god. <laughs> oh, don't worry. We, we had him on the run, anyways. <laughs> All right, let's see if uh, if we can summon anything. Uh, but yeah. don't summon it over the wasteland, because that, that area sucks. Ooh. Sea Serpent, 1,500. That, that would have been good that if you didn't been have 2,400 things out. Yeah. Oh, and this guy's a 500-400. Yeah, see, things are starting to shape up. You yeah. just need to start believing. I just got to believe in the power of the card. It's all the about cards. the heart of the card. So I'm going to put I'm gonna put this garbage creature down. Yeah, you're going to put him in defense mode? Yeah, I'm just going to put him in defense mode. Yeah, because he's the cheapest thing I have right now. Yeah. So let's put him down, and let's... Nope. Yeah, Another no, one. don't ruin the surprise. The nope, surprise nope, is when he goes to... He gets to go. kill Echo the Dolphin. Echo the dome. Oh, what a good game. No. This good whole experience boss. is very nostalgic for me. Feeling and frustrated that's... at Yu-Gi-Oh! Because, like, the base game... Which, I, I feel like the original Yu-Gi-Oh! Like, Season 1, that was the best iteration. Oh, I can defense mode him or move him. Yeah. I feel like I should move yeah, this if along you move, with... No, I'll leave that there. I'll put it in defense mode, though, so he's like, Oh, I'll go and attack him. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, if you move, it is default in attack mode. Because, like, you're yeah. not really defending if you're if advancing. You're moving around yeah. there. Oh, he's, he's... Oh, good. Oh, I could have tried that That's always else. great. Oh, and he got it. He got it. Yeah. It worked. It didn't bump it off. Nope. That's good. So, uh... Oh, well, hey. Oh, it worked. Oh, he activated the trap card because it's sweet, close sweet, enough. Sweet, 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 sweet. Okay. So, uh, it, it's too bad that we didn't lure him over the wasteland. So yeah, he would have had even lower power. Oh, what's oh, this? Oh, no. I remember this. Do you remember this in the show? Oh, yeah. It's going to turn it, into it the Mega into the Moth giant, or whatever yeah. it is. Oh, God. Oh, great. What? Oh. Yeah, so he's 1800, so if we can beat that. M move him up, yeah. No, no, no. Oh, move. Yeah, yeah. M move him up one, and then su see if you can summon somebody summon good directly next to him. on him. Yeah. yeah. No. No. <laughs> no, I can't. Good thing we got the melting red shadow. Yeah. Um, well, let's, well, well, let's, well, let's see if we can. Uh, let's try to fuse. Maybe we can. Well, well make sure that, that the best one is the last one. Oh, okay. then if it gets Just in case, off, yeah. yeah. You don't want to end up with the fucking red sludge man. As as, as your let's first see, line uh, of defense, bolt penguin. That, that that might be pretty good, like thunder and serpent kind yeah, of thing. Yeah, yeah, thunder that, serpent maybe. Yeah, thunder sea serpent. Let's. Uh, that sounds pretty good. Here's to hoping. Nope. Fuck. <laughs> God Nothing. Damn it. So okay. let's uh, defense mode. Um, yeah. Fuck. Yeah, I guess we're stuck. Yeah, I think we might just. This might be a, a wash here. Yeah, I mean there is the option to surrender. We That's could, true. We could surrender, we could surrender to and do the other one. That's true. That's true. I've always liked. We should probably do that. I've always liked Rex better. 
Yeah. Rex is pretty uh, So for the record, when it, when it goes better. to these, uh, if you don't want to watch uh, Calculon uh, whoop your face, if you press circle, it'll uh, just skip it. There yeah, you go. And then it just does this. Yeah. It shows you. Censored. Censors. Too violent. Too violent for kids. Yeah. You know what's too violent? What? Actual Yu-Gi-Oh. Oh, yeah. Yeah, no. the comic. Yeah, the, the manga's uh, I'm gonna, horrible. That's a... I'm gonna look it up. Let's see if I have anything Because there's like a very hand, famous... Be redeeming. Um, there's a very famous Yu-Gi-Oh comic. Uh, Yu-Gi-Oh manga. I'm just gonna type in... I'm not gonna type in hardcore. I was gonna do that. And I realized <laughs> that'd be a terrible... That would've been bad. Yeah, that would've been bad. Um, crazy, I guess? Uh, okay, we're gonna win one battle here before we concede. Because, uh... Yeah, this guy... Oh, you got him! I got an 1800 power nice. creature. Nice, yeah, and whoop his seven, ass. And a 1750. I'm gonna kill Calculon. I'm gonna watch it too, cause it's gonna be glorious. And then we'll then we'll, we'll probably concede, cause he's gonna. Destroy All right, I love us. that he's pink. Yeah. And almost furry. But also called Red Sea Serpent. Look at this title, <laughs> and he doesn't even. He used Surf from Pokemon. Yeah. He doesn't even attack. He just drowns him. He's like, you're not even worth my time. I like that they don't like. They don't react to their impending no. death. He mm. just slowly accepts it. All right, so uh, I, I'm on a website right now that's a, a retrospective of the Yu-Gi-Oh! manga's first seven crazy... Cr the first seven violent, crazy, awesome yeah. volumes. Um, okay. So let's see. Uh, where, where, where is it? Uh, duh, 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 duh. Um, Okay, what the? I mean, in the first. Okay, hold on. So I'm saving this image. I'm gonna show you this right now. So this is they, they don't they're given like the backstory. They're like, okay, so like Yugi isn't a really popular kid in school. He's picked on. Yeah. Uh, his dad is kind of like an outcast because he of a runs dork. like a game shop and or, which I guess is called like a tea shop or something like this. Yeah, it is. Um, but uh, the first picture they show of the manga has Yugi doing quite possibly the stupidest face. <laughs> Because he's fantasizing oh, about a yeah. girl. No, I've, I've yeah, I've, I've read the first few of them when when I was into Yu-Gi-Oh a lot. In the first one, I be I believe it's the first one, or it's the first few. Uh, Yugi uh, battles. He duels. I'm sorry. He duels uh, a a pedophile, and as punishment, when Yugi wins, Yami Yugi doesn't like banish him to the Shadow Realm or anything. That's that's not really a thing. But um, he he blinds him, but not like. 100% blinded. Everything the man sees for the rest of his life is pixelated. That is he, amazing. That's his punishment. Yami Yugi's like, you molested children? You want to know? Well, I mean, I don't know if he actually molested children. That's not in the comic. But, like, they, they talk about how, like, you know, he's, he's like a pervert. And then he's just like, you know what? You're gonna... Everything. Your whole vision is pixelated for the rest of time. And you're just like, that is... That is quite uh, a... I don't know. Adult topic material? For a... What is presented as a, a you know a children's show in the U.S. Mm -hmm. Whenever damage is inflicted oh. to life points in battle, the damage amount is reduced to zero. But oh. also, he has zero attack because of a wasteland. Yeah, effect. So, so so he's the back line. You want to protect yeah. him. Yeah, yeah. That's I want to keep him right next to me. What the hell is that middle guy? I don't like his face. Akihiron. Akihiron. Yeah, but, but but bring him up on the main. Oh God, no! Yeah, get get no, him off the main like screen. It's like a terrifying moth. Jesus Christ! Like a like water moth. Water moth. Oh, yeah. Why is it that if you have like a thing, it looks okay, but if you add water to the front of it, it looks terrifying, like water bear? Oh yeah, no, I right? Just, it's just water's kind of scary. And then water yeah. moth, water water spider. Oh, water spider, no good. That's, although that's although the little like water skitter thing, those yeah. are cool. That, that that's that's pretty awesome. So so I'm reading this. Um, and one of the uh, one of the things that happens here is uh, this guy who's picking on Yugi. Uh, his name is Ushio, and uh, he he like threatens Yugi, and he's like, "You owe me money," and he's yeah. like, "I don't have money." And then he goes home, figures out the money puzzle, and turns into Yami Yugi. Yami is like, "All right, I know how to deal with this punk." So he calls out this guy to meet him at midnight in like an alley. So the guy's like, "All right, that's a very Yami Yugi kind of right." Thing. So when they meet in the alley, they play this game, or he challenges to a game which he calls a shadow game. And the way it works, it's kind of like um, Five Finger Filet. 
Except instead of it being like like you put your hand then a knife if you're not familiar with five finger fillet you put your hand out and like you spread your fingers apart and then you take a knife and you stab the space between each finger and you keep going faster back and forth up until uh, you I guess you're just not comfortable doing it anymore and yeah then, or you cut your finger yeah off. or you cut your finger off um, so what they did is that he put a pile of money on each person's hand on the back of their hand and then they have to stab yep. the pile of money uh, where the trick is like. The deeper you go, the more money you get to keep, because you get to keep all the money that you stabbed. Yep. Um, the catch is that the more you go back and forth, the smaller the piles get, so you have to like really like manage your greed, otherwise you'll stab right through your hand. So, this kid is like, why don't I just kill Yugi and take all the money? You don't fuck with the shadow game. You don't fuck <laughs> with Yu-Gi-Oh. So he goes to stab Yugi in the face, but Yami Yugi's super powerful in magic. So he uh, he just jumps out of the way and he's like, "You done fucked up now, boy. Now you have to pay the penalty for messing with a shadow game." So he goes ahead and alters the guy's reality to start thinking that he is surrounded by piles of money, and he's just rolling around in this money. And it turns out he changes the perception. All he's rolling around in is dirt and garbage. Yep, that that is the actual uh, Yu-Gi-Oh. This is a card game for kids, guys. Yep. <laughs> it's on WB Kids, where it, it was. Yeah, it was. And, like, like, it's amazing to see the, like, looks on people's faces in this, in these little comics, uh, and, like, how dark it looks. This is some messed up stuff. Uh, so, uh, I'll, I, I will, uh, I'll read you guys another one. Um, I'll read you guys another one next time. We'll see how yeah. violent this can get we'll as, as we destroy Rex. This is going maybe this is going so much better. better. No one's been attacked even. Yeah, and, and, now there are these lanes of labyrinth. And I, I'm that just out. I'm laning it up. I'm trying to trying to make make <laughs> the best. Can you I can combine crawfish and crawfish? Double crawfish. Double crawfish. I mean, I'm gonna combine double crawfish with night lizard because okay. I'm hoping it might make something good. Yeah, let's see what happens next time. Yeah, bye guys. Bye. <laughs> Thanks for watching the video. Subscribe. Click the button. It's somewhere. It's like down here, maybe over there. I don't know what you're doing. It's somewhere. Subscribe. Like, comment, subscribe. Do the thing. Share it with your friends. Tell them. Tell your friends. They're people. They need to know. They need to... They could get the same thing that you're getting. You could have the thing. They could have the thing. You could both do the thing. You could... Yeah.